Time now 618. Welcome back to the news on this Wednesday. Take a look at our headlines as we see clear and chilly conditions in here overnight, but not quite as cold as we saw the past couple of mornings out there. A lot more lower 50s of the coast and actually a, a more sunshine tomorrow with warmer temperatures before we get our rain chance coming up heading into our Friday. And that'll be more Friday afternoon into the evening hours of the weekend looks to be nice. Next couple of hours, we're still tracking those 60s going through 9 p.m. Then we're back in the 50s. It will be a dry evening, so no rain locally on that fair and fair first alert live radar. We have high pressure and control up and down the uh, east coast here. We have a little bit more cloudiness across the century west with an area of low pressure with that cold front extending down into Texas along that frontal boundary. Yeah, out ahead of it, we have some showers and that will be our next rain chance coming up here by Friday evening. So tonight again, clear and chilly with those 40s for some inland areas, 50s along the coast, more sunshine coming up tomorrow, a little bit warmer. I think we'll see a lot of mid 70s, even though we get more clouds as the day goes on. We don't expect to see any rain tomorrow and we'll show you that as we go hour by hour, stopping it there at midnight, clear skies. Same story as you wake up on your Thursday as we go through the afternoon, a few more clouds, but we don't expect to see any rain coming up for our Thursday. So if you're working outside tomorrow, 8 a.m., lower 50s there at that 8 o'clock hour, and we'll have a little bit more sunshine still at noontime, 72, humidity a little bit higher as well than the past couple of days, 59%. Heading into your 5 o'clock hour, that's when we start to get a few more clouds. It'll be dry with temperatures still holding into the mid 70s. And we're looking at a high right about 76 for a lot of inland areas tomorrow. A little bit cooler at the beaches, but even they should be topping out looks like in the low to mid 70s for our Thursday afternoon. Let's give you an update on the tropics and we've been watching invest 94 L in the southern areas of the central Atlantic. Well, as of the 5 PM advisory, we now have tropical storm Tammy and we talked about this not really impacting the United States. This is going to be a tropical storm bringing some gusty winds and some rain into parts of the Windward Islands as we move on into the weekend. Then it takes a sharp turn to the north and then a northeasterly turn brings it back out over the open waters of the Atlantic. So no threat to our area, but you can track it right now over the next several days on the WTOC first alert weather app. Let's get into that seven day forecast and we keep it dry tomorrow. There's your rain chance coming up Friday. Friday starts out dry. The rain chance will be here mid to late afternoon, probably sometime around one to two o'clock inland and then making its way through the area. An isolated thunderstorm can't be ruled out. Doesn't look like it's going to be severe and should be moving off the coast. All computer models suggest by midnight leading to a much nicer weekend. We'll have the sunshine. Temperatures are below average, but just slightly. So it's low to mid 50s in the morning. Afternoon highs in the low to mid 70s. That continues right through Wednesday. Well,